All right, I thought all day long, <coughs> all night, <coughs> uh -oh. all night long, what am I going to cook tonight for dinner? At the last minute, a couple hours ago, uh, yeah, I'm going to cook that. And then it switched to that, and then they added a little bit more of something else. And this is the final product. The onion. Onion. Onion, union, whatever. Multi-layered. Alright. Now, this is something I've never done. I have some dollar store jarred onions. I do not like canned onions. I do not like canned anything. I'm stuck with canned tomatoes, canned chili. So anytime I can take something out of the can, I'm a happy camper. All right, I'm squeezing some mushrooms to get the juice out. We're going to lay this with some mushrooms. Mix it up. We're going to do a quick pause for the cause because we don't like to do long videos. Reason why is 4K takes forever to upload and I don't have enough time in my life anymore. We're going through a cycle. We're in a, about to enter my next level. So quick pause for the cause. For all the pizza makers out there, they know that the last thing when they're making a pizza that's got mushroom on it, you put it on last, you squeeze out all the moisture and the mushrooms. Why do you do that? Because it makes a better pizza. Right. Washing our hands. We're going to the next level, which is what? We're doing some broccoli rob over the top. Reason why is the broccoli rob, we don't care. We're only putting this in here for bitterness. Jews got a secret. Every every time they have their secret dinner, their yearly, one of the ingredients is honey, and the other is a bitter herb. I have some bitter melon, but... This is Broccoli Rob. This is a secret of the Italians. This is probably the most bitter herb out there. I've done bitter herb. You could do J.W. Burrell bitter herb and can't touch this. Me, this is raw, cleaned, chopped, frozen Broccoli Rob. Although I love broccoli rob, I love spinach, I love, hold on, Brussels sprouts, broccoli rob is the best of the best. Actually, you know something I have to sprinkle this on? This is jalapeno. This is going to stay crunchy, we hope. It's almost time for some ham. We're going to sprinkle that on. Then the egg. Then a little Romano cheese. And actually, you know something? We're going to the next level. Every time I cook something, I bring it to the next level. Obviously, you know, I'm cooking something right now that no human has ever eaten. Look how good that looks. That pink. Men love pink. This is brain food. This, if you eat this every day, you will be smarter. Uh-oh, I spilled the beans again. Cat out of the bag. 
look how pretty this looks. Damn. I hate doing these long videos. They take forever to upload in 4K and eventually I'll be in 8K. I need to start what? Uploading and walking away and then coming back and editing. All right. We were going one way, now we're going to the other. Hold on. Pause for the cause. I need the right. This is shiitake mushroom powder. So we're only going lightly. We already have mushrooms as our base. This one is, didn't hear it here, but if you Google shiitake mushroom cancer, you'll see a bunch of stuff. All right, it's time to pause for the cause. We need some egg that's going to the fridge. Uh oh, one almost made it to the table. Mm. Green is good, green is God. This right here, we're gonna probably turn it into green goop. You'll be there. I won't call it green goop, I'll call it Peruvian green sauce. Love you. Alright, I use my giant spatula to push the ingredients down to the bottom. This is not McDonald's putting an egg into a mold. We have to make everybody happy. That is why we all live together in this world. And with all the outside influences, There you go. Watch. Push down, push down, push down, push down, push down, push down. I'm wrapping it around, and that is how you do a frittata. Wipe off all the egg. Next step. Oops, made a mess. Final step is clean the table after we're done with what? Hard cheese, baby. Dr. Oz and his comments about hard cheese are very important. Everyone believes Dr. Oz. Then after Dr. Oz, there was Dr. Axe. Do you know why Dr. Axe came along? Because I started beating up songs and calling them Dr. Axe. Dr. Axe told me a couple things. Thank you, Dr. Axe. And that is my frittata. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Next level, we want some cayenne pepper. Light dusting, very light. And there is my frittata of the night. I'm going to turn that into a burrito. You Obviously, you're on my channel. You know I turn everything into burritos. Do you know why I turn everything into burritos? That's how I kept my grandfather alive. So, if you're on my predicament, I'm going to teach you how to make a burrito. Taco Bell loves me. All right, there's my frittata. Next video, frittata flip.